A man from Snyder County got more than he expected when picking up a U-Haul truck over the weekend. A stowaway kitten hiding inside. It somehow squeezed its way into the dashboard. Newswatch 16's Peggy Lee explains how the man and the kitten made the 20 hour round trip to Indiana and back together. A quick glance at Stephen Lang's t-shirt, you can tell he's a cat lover. The man from Middleburg fosters several cats for the Animal Resource Center of Millville. But the way he came to have this little kitten is a bit unique. He found it hiding in a U-Haul truck he'd rented on Sunday night for a trip to Indiana to pick up work supplies. He and his fiance and baby had stopped at a Dollar General around 9 o'clock before he headed west. We found her at the Dollar General just meowing like crazy for her life. And it was just a, such a sad, sad, sad thing to see. This video shows that kitten tucked behind the truck's spare tire. The cat jumped out of the truck and Lang spent three hours trying to catch her, finally bringing her into the truck's cab. I wiggled her way loose, got on the dashboard and went right up underneath the dashboard like a mouse. Lang still needed to get to Annapolis, so he did, with the kitten crying from beneath the dashboard on the 20 hour round trip trek. He found some sounds of a mother cat calling for her litter on YouTube and played it to calm her down. She was talking like it, like it was her mom outside of the dashboard. Lang says it was the last five hours of his trip back home when things got really interesting. She decided to urinate inside the vents, which that's where they pull the air from for the air conditioning. After breathing that smell for hours, his connections at the rescue shelter got him set up with Chevrolet Cadillac of Bloomsburg, where mechanic Nathan Colvert took apart the dashboard and got the kitten out. Culver even gave it a nickname he felt was the right fit. Dash. Lang plans to adopt the eight week old kitten. As for a name, he's torn between Dash and U-Haul. Peggy Lee, Newswatch 16.